today on 11th Gorgeous. Bunder. <laughs> Bunder. It's like dirty as dirt. <laughs> Forever 21. Can you imagine a 19 inch curling iron? Mmm. <laughs> Get you some. Hey guys. It is the end of the month and you know what that means. Time to tell you our favorite items of September. It sure is. If you guys have seen any of our hauls this month, you know we've kind of been going a little crazy on the jewelry. Yes. So I have my new Forever 21 for tw little. They remind me of Dana because Lolly Dolly 128. She likes to wear the kind of chandelier bigger. and yeah, bigger earrings. So I just love them with the golden cream. Love Shut them. up. Yeah. Also, my Brandy Melville bracelets that I got. Been loving those. I've been rocking them almost every day. I got the gold pyramid one, black skulls, and the black one with the cross. Steph has those too. <laughs> I've been rocking them as well. We recently got this necklace. This is kind of another jewelry favorite. Uh, we've been loving the statement necklaces, obviously. Like, obviously. I love them. But um, we found this one at H&M. It's similar to the one that Tracy wore to IMAX in June, but it's in black, so it's a really classy one. But we love this. It's kind of J. Crew esque in a different geometric way. Yeah. It's got the same kind of shape. Yes. So we love that, and we decided to get something from Jewel Mint. We, the necklaces that we wanted from there were out, the little bib necklaces. I know, they're so freaking cute. They're like a necklace, but they look like a collar, like, yeah. a, like a bejeweled metal collar. Kind of like the Peter Pan like trend, collar mm -hmm. trend, for the people that are kind of scared to wear big collars because it's so dainty and delicate with being little rhinestones and stuff. So as soon as those come back in stock, if they come back in stock, we're going to be on it like... Donkey Tonto. Kong. We're going to jump on it like yeah. Tonto. So instead of getting a necklace, we decided, you know, we've been getting necklaces a lot from Jewel Mint. Let's get some earrings. Mm -hmm. And we actually had some really cute earrings that we were wearing in LA that were similar to these two. We really like the marble drop earrings and the geometric shift earrings. They kind of have a similar vibe to them. They kind of give like almost an antique -y, but geometric at the same time, feeling, I think the marble drop are a little bit more antique-y. Yeah. And the geometric ones are just fun. We're on the fence about which ones to get, so how about we include them and let them help yeah. us decide? Yeah. Should we get both of them? Like, should we each get one? And or, share. Yeah, like, or should we just get one and get the same, like? Which ones do you guys like more, the marble drop or the geometric shift? Let yeah, us know down below. We're, we're confused on what we want. But we definitely want some more statement earrings because I feel like we're getting our necklaces, we're not getting our earrings. Yeah. And then I want some chunkier bracelets. Well, another thing I know is that for the fall, you don't necessarily, like if you're wearing scarves and things like that, you're not going to be wearing right. the necklaces. So you so need all of your statement to be right here. Or even bracelets are hard to do in the fall, winter, yeah. because you're bundling up and your arms are but covered. But you can put them over sweaters. I true, love doing that. True, true. So we'll link Jewel Mint down below as well as the code if you guys want to go check it out if you never have. If you guys saw our Get Ready With Me videos, we both are loving this Too Faced Natural Eye Palette. We've had it for a really long time, but lately I've been doing the matte look across the top row, which is what I have on today. I have it on too. I yeah. copied that. Whole. And if you want to see how we do it, or at least how I do my matte look, it's in my Get Ready With Me video, so it's kind of like a kind of like a tutorial on my everyday look. But loving this palette. Mmm. <laughs> Get you some all over the place with my moisturizers lately but recently when we were in LA we got like a little goodie bag full of stuff from Beautycon and the proactive green tea moisturizer was one of them and I have been struggling with dry skin like right in here and stuff and actually my moisturizers have been burning I feel like when I put them on it's so dry yeah so this has been really good for my skin and I've been using it like I mean every day since we got it so and it's oil free oh, love this for lips I've been loving two products so when I get ready in the morning I'll put this Kors lip butter and jasmine on and it smells so good. Like I didn't realize how much, I just always think you want to know. <laughs> so I'm like, I like here. here. <laughs> I didn't realize how much I love jasmine until like recently, but this is smell like jasmine. I don't know. It's good. I love it. And it doesn't really give color, but it's just really moisturizing for chapped lips. And then the other is this gloss. I got this at a, like a local spa place. It was kind of weird. It's a spa and salon, but it's pure illumination, natural hydrating lip try. therapy. And it's thelanocompany.com. We'll link it down below. I don't know anything about it, but it's in Shimmer. <laughs> and it's really cool because it has a mirror on it and a light. Ooh. 
And yeah, so Steph wants some. And it has like a like a caramelly something scent. And just use the mirror and the light if you're in the dark, because that's where I always put my lip gloss on. In the dark. The product this month I've been loving Sunset Angora. And we got this. Actually, we we were gonna get the color the model hat on because we really liked the model uh, for this new L'Oreal lipstick. And it didn't seem like it was the, the right, right color. color, yeah. So we opted for one that we just thought was really pretty and we love it. It's got really good formula. It's really moisturizing. And it's Caress. Yeah, it's the Caress line, so it's new. I have this on my nails. It is Bunder. Bunder. <laughs> Bunder. Butter London Queen Vic. And it's this great raspberry, almost ox bloody type color. If you want to see more oxblood type color nail polishes, check out our blog egnails.com. We're going to have a post on all kinds of different priced nail polishes that you can get the oxblood color. For me for nails, uh, I got the Essie Carry On right after Tracy did and it took me a while to use it, but I flipping love it and like when I put it on, Matt was like, that's like a purpley, like reddish color. Like he could see that it wasn't yeah. black. And every time I, I test it, because I know it's, you know, if a guy can tell, then it's it's good. Mm -hmm. Like I put on one that was like a green tone dark color that looked almost black. And he was like, it, it's a green, greeny gray color. Oh, Matt's getting so yeah, with yeah. it. So yeah, so he could tell. So uh, this is really fun. It's kind of similar with the Ox Bloody. It's, I feel like it's darker. Yeah. Like more dark than what people would consider It's like Ox really blood. dried old ox blood. Yeah, it's the dry, <laughs> dirty, weak old ox blood. <laughs> but it's Essie Carry On and it's so vampy and we, we love, love it. it. Okay, so for perfume, really been loving this. We actually got the sample in our glossy box. It was in like a towelette formula, which was really cool. We've never seen perfume in a towelette before. But it's called Blushed and we'll link the website down below. This was only like 15 or $16 for this rollerball. And it just has a nice like lemony, vanilla, Sounds so weird, but I just love it. It's such, oh, I rubbed my wrist together. I'm sorry, you guys hate that. You know what, that's why we love you guys, because we learn things we didn't know before we put videos up, and that's what this is all about. Okay, so two kind of face products that I've been loving is the Sonia Kasha Hidden Agenda Concealer Palette, and I feel like I used everything that I talked about, except for the lipstick in, in our Get Ready With uh, Me tag. So I love this because you get everything, like you get an under the eye, like, salmon-y type concealer and then you get like your lighter one for blemishes and stuff so love this and then for like bronzery -ness, I've been using you can tell I've been using it's like dirty as dirt uh, the dirt NYX, is very <laughs> dirty the NYX bronzer blusher combo in Ibiza. Ibiza that's another thing we learned from you guys for our hair tool this month we have really been loving the 32 millimeter curling wand this is from Numi and you can actually enter our Get Ready With Me tag giveaway video where you can possibly win this. We're giving four yes. tools away, so like you get to pick whichever one you want. But this is the 32 millimeter wand, and Steph used it today. I did. It's for looser curls, it's yeah. for bigger curls. It's not for your spiral ones that I would do with my um, smaller 19, 19 yeah. inch millimeter one. 19 inch millimeter? 19, <laughs> my 19 millimeter. Can you imagine a 19 inch curling iron? <laughs> hold better than the ones with the clips. I don't know. I think it's like more of your hair is touching it. Yeah. I don't know what it is. It's just, it seems like it's a, it's a more uniform heat and it's a hotter like yeah. curling iron. But I don't have to use hairspray and make yeah. my hair all crunchy and nasty. Yeah. For the two people we've been loving for this month, we have two. Two. Because <laughs> I just said two. <laughs> okay, the first one is somebody that we met. We've seen her at events, but we've never been like, hey, nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. Uh, and it's that's her. Yeah. And we've always loved her. She's super sweet, and I love her videos, and she's cute. I There's nothing bad to be said about her. Uh, she's amazing, and she's so sweet and cute in person. Like, she was like, you guys have that thing that go get you some. And, like, I love that she knows that. Yeah. And it was it's, so fun. It's nice to meet other gurus that you watch and you know about them and for them to know about you. Right. Back. Like, no matter who they are, big or small, anything, just anybody on YouTube knowing. Yeah. What you do and what you're but about. But, like, I like cool. to tell people um, when we meet them, like, something about their videos. Like, it is a huge community, but at the same time, like... For people who've been around for a really long time watching, like, you know, yeah. yeah, you know a lot of people, and you've seen them, and it's just 
fun. Our second one is one that like we've been talking about people being around for a long time. Mm -hmm. She's been around, I feel like, since Same the beginning. Same time as us. Yeah. yeah. And it's I L Y Jessica. O M G. Yes. That's her name. I L Y Jessica. O M G. And she's a twin, so that's really cool. We're not twins, but we love that. We get it all the time. We might as well be twins. I know it's creepy, but she does have a twin, and sometimes they make videos together, and I think they do twin vlogs together. Yeah. And but she has a beauty channel, and she does really fun outfits. I love her style. I know. I like, want to be her. It'll be like thrift store. You know, this. It's yeah. like totally attainable. I'm like, can I say how excited I was when I found out that the Target combat boots that we wanted, that we liked, that she already got them? Right. It's like, it's like Jessica approved. Yeah. And we love her style. So it's like just a little bit closer to her style. <laughs> just a little bit. Just a little bit. So we'll link them down below for you to go check them out. Yes. Make sure you tell them we sent you. Absolutely. And if there's anyone we should check out, let us know down below. And we want to know your beauty favorites down there. You can just comment it or leave a video response. And we will talk to you guys in our next video. We sure will. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.